Robert Bob Scott Lazar, widely known as Bob Lazar, has long been a figure shrouded in mystery and controversy. Born on January 26, 1959 in Coral Gables, Florida, Lazar's childhood was marked by a precocious interest in science and technology. His fascination with the stars and the mysteries of the universe was apparent from a young age. Growing up, Lazar often tinkered with electronics and mechanical devices, demonstrating an innate curiosity and talent for engineering. This early passion set the stage for a life that would eventually thrust him into the public eye in the most extraordinary way. Lazar attended Pierce Junior College in Los Angeles and later claimed to have degrees from MIT and Caltech, though verification of these credentials has proven elusive. His professional life took a dramatic turn in the late 1980s when he asserted that he had been employed at a secretive site known as S4 near Area 51. It was here, Lazar alleged, that he worked on reverse engineering extraterrestrial technology. Lazar's claims about his work with alien spacecraft introduced the world to the concept of Element 115, a substance he stated was used to fuel the advanced propulsion systems of these crafts. According to Lazar, this element could produce gravity waves, a theory which, if true, would revolutionize our understanding of physics and propulsion. While Element 115, also known as Muscovium, was synthesized by scientists in 2003, it has yet to demonstrate the properties Lazar described. Beyond his controversial claims about UFOs, Lazar's career has had some fascinating and less well-known chapters. For instance, he once ran a photo processing business and a company that sold jet engines to car enthusiasts. His inventive spirit even led him to convert a Honda CRX to run on hydrogen, a feat that underscored his practical engineering skills and innovative thinking. Lazar's personal life, too, is filled with intriguing details. He has been married multiple times and currently resides in Michigan, where he runs a scientific supply company. Despite his controversial reputation, Lazar has continued to engage with the public through various means, including documentaries and interviews, often reiterating his experiences at S4 and his views on extraterrestrial life. A lesser-known aspect of Lazar's story involves his advocacy for scientific curiosity and open-mindedness. Regardless of the skepticism surrounding his claims, Lazar has consistently encouraged people to question the status quo and explore the unknown. His narrative, though polarizing, has inspired a generation of UFO enthusiasts and conspiracy theorists to look beyond accepted scientific boundaries and consider the possibility of advanced extraterrestrial civilizations. In his own words, Lazar has often emphasized the importance of pushing scientific frontiers. I want to get people excited about science. The universe is far more wondrous than we can imagine. And if my story encourages people to look up and ask questions, then it's worth it. Bob Lazar's life is a tapestry of curiosity, controversy, and ingenuity. Whether one views him as a whistleblower of extraordinary truths or a purveyor of tall tales, his impact on popular culture and the ongoing discourse about extraterrestrial life is undeniable. His journey from a curious child in Florida to a globally recognized figure in the UFO community exemplifies the profound human drive to explore, understand, and believe in the extraordinary.